Hosea chapter 4, verse 1, little side teaching called when to not strive and when to not preach. We are a preaching church, but there are some rare times where you say, oh, I'm not going to preach. I'm not going to strive here. And this is from the Lord. This is his instruction. Listen to this. Verse 1 through 5. Hear the word of the Lord, ye children of Israel. For the Lord hath a controversy with the inhabitants of the land, because there is no truth, nor mercy, nor knowledge of God in the land. By swearing and lying and killing and stealing and committing adultery, they break out, and blood toucheth blood. Therefore shall the land mourn, and every one that dwelleth therein shall languish with the beast of the field and with the fowls of heaven. Yea, the fishes of the sea also shall be taken away. Yet let no man strive nor reprove another. For thy people are as they that strive with the priest. Therefore shall thou fall in the day, and the people also shall fall with thee in the night, and I will destroy thy mother. So we think we preach hard in Hosea. He's like, God's going to kill your mom. That's some good hard preaching. So don't strive. He's like, because they're a reprobate nation. They have crossed the line. There's no point in preaching and striving with them. They're like somebody who strives with the priest. A real priest stands on the law of God. He's not going to be convinced of anything else. He's not going to let somebody tell him something else. He's like, no, the law of God says this. So I'm not going to strive with you about that. It's like hitting a brick wall. So like, there are some ones. Let me give you an example. Pedophile prayer. I won't preach it. They're all reprobates. There's no point in preaching it. Okay? Uh, a training uh, convention. No, well, won't preach it. They're all reprobates. So why do we go to the, preach the, the different homo parades? Three reasons. It's not for those reprobates. I, actually, I want to speed their judgment up. So I guess that'd be four reasons. Speed their judgment up so they commit suicide faster. But I said, witness against the city itself. Against the cops, the chief of police, the city itself. It's a witness against them. Two, for the homo hoggers. And three, for the disciples. You're going to grow, Levi, preaching three faggot parades in May and June. Three in a row. Have you ever, I know you've done one in Phoenix here and there. But have you ever done three in a row within five weeks? Boom, boom, boom. Well, we've done this seven years. You're going to grow. It's going to be good. It's a great reminder. So it's for the disciples, for a witness against the city, and it's for the homo hoggers. But if it was a straight pedophile training for no. I don't strive with them. They're, 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 no. Pray some Muslim girl blows them up. I'm not blowing them up. I'm not telling you to. But pray a Muslim goes and blows them up. Absolutely. But I don't care. It could be another training that goes and blows them up. They're so crazy. And so, um, you know, this, th these are why we do these things. And there are times that you're to not strive. Amen.